Well, thanks to an anonymous contributor for answering my question regarding uh, trying to get into this sample application uh, that's listed under the, uh, the solid, the Inrupt website. Um, he told me that uh, the big step that I was missing is I didn't add the CD. This right here, CD, change directory, which I had read before, but I didn't think that that was the problem. But anyway, good to know now. So I went ahead and I was able to do the ng serve. Tells me that my global Angular CLI version is greater than my local version. Uh, so the local one is used to disable this warning. We don't care, I don't think. So, compiled successfully. Now what does this mean? Oh! Okay. Right, so says the local host, since that did not work last time, but we got it to work this time. Service ID provider. Uh, we're going to do interrupt. Do you have a solid identity? Yes. Uh, so go. Mm, here's my username. Okay, so this, yet again, I'm going to have to register. Alright, see, my web ID is different. Now we've got the dev.interrupt. Okay. Alright, so I am, I <laughs> was still just continuing playing around, figured uh, yeah, that I would go ahead and reopen the localhost 4200, and when I did, it has changed already. Um, menu item 1, 2, 3, this is the sample app, profile demo app. So... See if I log in, what does that do? Uh, nothing. All right, let's go back. Yeah, do that. Let's try going on with my community login. Here we go. Okay. So, there we go. I'm still bare bones. Still quite interesting, though. It is definitely exciting to see this coming along and how, even just in a few hours, things are already beginning to change and build up. Um, I would definitely love to know if anybody else out there is uh, trying to create something on here and uh, share some of your successes or your failures and inspire the rest of us.